Sports. We're looking live at a picture of DFW Airport, and it's a beautiful evening, but it's been a frustrating day for thousands of American Airlines passengers after the airline canceled hundreds of flights across its system. Now, Caroline Vandergriff is at the airport looking into what is causing all of the problems. Travel this Halloween weekend has become a nightmare for a lot of passengers who plan to fly in and out of DFW Airport. It may look business as usual here, but we're told once you get inside security, the line for customer service is hours long. American Airlines confirmed it was forced to cancel 427 flights today. According to FlightAware, 195 of those were either coming to or traveling from DFW Airport. American says two days of severe winds in North Texas, with gusts up to 50 miles per hour on Thursday, drove a large number of cancellations at DFW, since the airline could only use two runways here instead of the usual five. Because of that, staffing began to get tight as crew members were put out of their regular flight sequences. The airline went ahead and proactively canceled flights in an attempt to minimize the inconvenience for travelers. American says most of the customers impacted by the changes are being rebooked the same day. But we talked to some passengers who say their new flights got canceled as well. So then they moved us to another flight, which is 3.30, so I just totally gave up. Because once I went down to customer service at gate 24, on the inside of the terminal from C24 all the way down to C5, it's just tons of people in line from cancellation flights all day. It's very frustrating. Um, the last two times I've flown American Airlines, we have had nothing but issues. According to Flight Aware, American Airlines has already canceled 126 flights in and out of DFW Airport tomorrow and more than 300 total. A company spokesperson told us they don't have final numbers for Sunday yet. American did say staffing should get better in just a matter of days. More than 1,800 flight attendants are returning from leave on November 1st, with the remainder coming back the month after that and 600 new hire flight attendants are going to start by the end of the year. At DFW Airport, I'm Caroline Vandergriff, CBS 11 News.